Hey you guys, what is going on? GIGO Gamer here and today we are um, here playing something pretty cool. This is what you call Minecraft. And recently Minecraft had something special happen. It was called the uh, Minecraft 1.9 update. And today I shall showcase Minecraft 1.9. Guys, thank you so much for tuning in to today's video. Today we are going to be showing a load of stuff about Minecraft 1.9. Now, it's going to be a lot of cool stuff, a lot of new stuff. So don't expect it to be anything like you've seen before. Let's get started with the armor. As you can see, I have every type of armor, leather, gold, chain, iron, and I'm wearing diamond. Let's look at the armor. It now shows you how much armor it actually gives you. So, as you can see, when on head, one armor. When on body, three. Legs, two. Feet, two. So that right there, you can only have a max of seven armor. One, three, five. Okay, so a little better, a little better. The chain is where it really gets quite a bit better. Because, um compared to this. Gold is like a little bit better, but chain really upgrades it. And then iron is two armor for the feet, is five armor for the legs, six for the chest plate, and two for the helmet. So the helmets, the hel iron helmet is equivalent to gold uh, and a chain mail. Now let's go check out the diamonds. Three armor on the feet, six armor on the legs, eight armor on the body and three on the helmet this is just vanilla with no enchants you can see quite a different range one to three three to eight two to six one to three comparing leather to diamond it's a pretty big difference so that's one part of 1.9 um, I also believe they severely nerfed the durability uh, if I remember correctly which is interesting It's very interesting now we'll get on to uh, part two. We'll take our fishing rod and some cows. But wait, how are we supposed to get off of this massive tower? What are those, you might ask? Well, that does look very interesting. It looks like a pair of wings. Can it be that that my Minecraft has wings that is right guys minecraft now has wings that you can use for gliding uh... And i will demonstrate it goes on the chest piece spot you cannot wear a chest plate while you're flying with these so be very careful if you're in a pvp situation be sure that you have your hotkeys set up that you can just quickly switch now let's test them out so in order to use the elytra wings all you have to do is jump double tap as if you were gonna fly in creative and then wherever you point think of yourself as a glider wherever you point that's where you'll go if you try to go up too much you will stall and crash they're very interesting you do take durability damage when you hit and you do take fall damage if you don't land <clears throat> smoothly so that's a thought about it now let's uh, test out the fishing rods now if you guys remember in Hypixel or not in Hypixel sorry but in Sky Wars fishing rods were very useful for being able to go boink and knock someone off the edge but that didn't just happen check this out guys in Minecraft 1.9 fishing rods no longer knock uh, entities back they actually drag them towards you and the farther you, oh goodness, oh goodness, the farther you run back, the farther they will fly. Very interesting. Yes, very interesting. Oh no, we're being shot at by some skeletons. This could be bad. Unless, yeah, this is bad. So that's game mode one. Whew. We gotta get out of here. But what if we needed to take those guys out? What if we could just equip ourselves some diamond armor? Take out... Wait a minute. Attack speed? In one, Minecraft 1.9, swords still do the same amount of damage, and they all have a 1.6 attack speed, which is pretty fast. 
uh, the bigger the number, the faster it is. So that's pretty fast. Uh, and it's the same damage. Take a look at this. A wooden axe does the same amount of damage as a diamond sword. It has about half of the attack speed. Interesting. Gold, same thing, but quite a bit faster. Stone, 9 attack damage with a .8 attack speed. Iron with 9, with .9, and diamond, the final, with 9 attack damage and 1 attack speed. That's pretty crazy. Uh, that's really crazy. Why would they do that, you might ask. We'll demonstrate in just a minute. Also, you have a shield, which you can equip. Because Minecraft 1.9 has dual wielding. How cool is this? We are now literally a knight in shining diamond armor. Also, Golden Apples and God Apples recently had a bit of a, a nerf. At least uh, God Apples did. So, before we get into that, let's test out the shield. As well as the brand new 1.9 fighting tactics. So, as you can see here, Right clicking no longer makes you shield with your sword. It brings up a shield which you can use to defend yourself from any attack. Check this out. Also in Minecraft 1.9, mobs now will attack each other. Especially uh, zombies and skeletons. Now check this out. As I swing, notice it doing like a swinging little motion. Check that out. It's pretty crazy. And notice how it goes down and comes back up? Let's go look into our um, video settings. We'll put it by the crosshair for now. Watch right beside my little aiming reticle. Notice that sword as it fills up. In Minecraft 1.9, you no longer have to jitter click. You now actually can't jitter click. Jitter clicking now will cause you to do less damage than before. The reason for this is, in order to do a damaging attack, you have to swing, wait for that bar to fill, and swing again. That's the only way to do <clears throat> actual damage reliably. So this is where the attack speed comes in. Oh goodness. Oh goodness. Oh goodness. So this is where the attack speed comes in. Swing. 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 So a, a sword has a pretty good attack speed. An axe is... Oh goodness. Dead. Oh goodness. Good thing we have keep inventory and wings. Except for I didn't activate them. Okay, let's go back down here. Oh, come on! Don't be so rude. Oh, I took them off. Put these bad boys back on. <laughs> Fly away. No land ho! And if you see you try to go up too much, you will crash land. Notice this mob. Notice how I'm flying without actually being able to fly. This is a brand new mob type. It is called a shulker. And basically what he does is he can elevate you and oh, these mobs are really getting unbearable. You can only hit him when he's opened up. I'm trying to crouch, trying to get down. He's shooting at me. Look at this. Look at this guy. He's making us all fly. That's crazy. Look at that. That's nuts. And then he'll just drop you and make you take loads of fall damage. It's really quite interesting. Oh, goodness. This is getting really hard to explain to all these mobs. Let's do time, set, day. Okay, this will make it easier. So, in order to kill a shulker, he has to not be in block form, as he is right now. This, right now, you can... Oops. The block form, I believe you can kill him however it takes a lot more hits it's like armor so let's keep moving on quickly I don't want to ramble too much god, god apples 
used to give you fire resistance regen, uh, like everything you could need. Now, if you eat it, you actually get two, four, six, eight absorption hearts. And then this right here. Regen for like 20 seconds. Eight absorption hearts, though. That's pretty crazy if you think about it. Oh, goodness. So, God Apples uh, are still pretty neat. But I wouldn't... I don't know. It's kind of hard to compare them. Let me know what you guys think down in the comments. Um, let me actually game mode 1 and grab two things. A milk bucket so we can get rid of all these status effects. And a diamond hoe. Now if you check this out. A diamond hoe has one attack damage and four attack speed. Now this quite literally means you can attack non-stop. Look at that little reticle you guys remember seeing. You can just swing, 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 swing. It's really crazy. So, another strategy. Now, let me drink this milk. Slash, oh, whoops. Slash game mode zero. Slash game mode zero. Okay, now let's eat a regular golden apple. Regen two and absorption. Pretty much the same thing. Um, so, what else? We've gone through that. I'll show you what the actual shulker, or what it actually does without us being like under attack. Okay, this is a shulker. Can barely hit him. He does have quite a bit of armor, as you can see. So you need to hit him when he's open. Oh, bust you, dude. So quite a good strategy for these guys is to have the elytra wings. As you can see, levitation. Look at that. It's pretty crazy. Okay, he's about to drop me. Never mind, he just hit me with another one of those. So essentially you want to dodge those little ball thingies. Ready? Oh, I couldn't do it. Kind of tricky, kind of tricky. Uh, so that's basically 1.9 in a nutshell. Um, an entirely new combat system. Gliders. Um, let me know what you guys think. A lot of people really hate it. A lot of people really love it. I personally think it's a lot of fun. Um, it's it's just really cool. Uh, also, I'll go through one more thing real super fast. There's now tipped arrows. So if you go look, you can now get arrows with potion effects. Instant health, strength, regen, poison, luck, weakness, instant damage, water breathing, jump boost, fire resistance. Uh, it, it's crazy. Invisibility. Now, there's one new arrow that I don't know if I can test for you guys. Let me find it. It's called a spectral arrow. Now, let me see if I can test it. Uh, I'm going to try. Get some cows, I guess. Okay, now check this out. Let's see if it works. So if I spawn a cow over here... Okay, it doesn't actually work. Now, with players and a spectral arrow, if you were to shoot... Oh, it does work. They just don't have enough health, and you have to fully charge the bow. What mob has enough health to survive it? A slime, maybe? Hmm, let's see. Okay, apparently it doesn't like to work on him. Oh, no, I just ran out of the arrow. Spectral. Okay, check this out. Spectral arrow. Let's see if it'll work. There we go. Look at that. We can now you can now see through blocks if you shoot a player with a spectral arrow. You can spot them and then when it runs out, I mean, it'll run out. Let's see if we can get the potion effect. Uh, let me see if I can. I don't know if you can shoot yourself with one. You would never want to in a PVP situation. Oh, it's too high. Okay, you can glowing and it makes yourself see through. Uh, it's really cool. So, tipped arrows, there's also now lingering potions, which basically is a potion that you can throw, uh, and it creates like a cloud that if you walk in, you get the effect. It's really cool. It really is. So, guys, that's pretty much it. Um, fishing rods, axes doing loads of damage, brand new PvP, 
technique, wings that you could fly with, so a new mob, so much cool stuff. Let me know what you guys think down in the comments below. Um, I love it. I really do. But guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you did enjoy today's episode. If you did, be sure to hit that like button. Leave a comment. Let me know what you think. Subscribe if you want to see any more content on my channel. Hope you guys like the new thumbnails that I've been making. Uh, uh, as well as the double upload times. Been doing my best. Guys, I hope you enjoyed this 1.9 show through. Or walk through. And I'll see you in the next video. Good.